I'm a keen Palmer, professional boxer from Liverpool, Topston, five and all. I started boxing when I was nine. My brother walked me down the gym because I was always messing about on the streets around here, just fucking around. <laughs> Not even fucking around on the streets. I was, I was just, I was fighting with all the kids. So obviously, because I was mess, fighting with all the kids around here, just messing around. When I was younger, just on the park. Cause my dad, he had a pub down the road on on Berkeley, so I used to just play out a lot. And yeah. And then he took me down the gym. Obviously, what, what, the Golden Gloves when he was there. And now, yeah, now fast forward, what, thirty years? Um, I just fell in love with it. So like, and I, I, I was good at it as well. But when I first got into it, I didn't take it serious. But I was I was good at it, but I just messed around and stuff like that. Didn't take it as serious. And then as I got older, realized like if you, when you're doing it, you gotta do it properly. Don't, Point just mate, wasting your time. But it's not even giving it all in the fight. You've got to give it all for your training. I want you, obviously if you take every box and training, come fight night. It, it should if you've got it should be a breeze, shouldn't it? But obviously you you put it all in the gym, leave not an unturned and go into the fight confident that you're you're gonna win. And obviously I like I'm winning, right? I don't plan on losing. I'm just just keep saying and working hard and just gotta keep gotta keep winning. That's the mentality I Going to the, like, that's what I've got. Me and Wayne are close, are very, very close. Everyone knows how close we are. It's like, he's like, uh, I wouldn't say, he's like, he's a go to person. So, like, if, I, if I've got a problem, I can call Wayne and he'll, he'll, he'll tell me whether I'm right or I'm wrong. He's honest, straightforward. The chemistry is there. So, like, he's open and honest with me. I'm open and honest with him. So, like, honest, if you're honest with each other, like, that's all that matters, doesn't it? So, like, I'm very close, everyone knows that. It's good because everyone's, everyone's excited towards the date, and we're all, everyone's bouncing off each other's energy in the gym, pushing towards. Obviously, everyone's got the same fight date, so it's like we're all working towards the same goal type of thing. Obviously, everyone, but everyone's on their own path and journey, but we're all, obviously, everyone's got the same end result, haven't they? You know what I mean? So it's not that we're pushing each other further, it's just that everyone's in camp at the same time. So everyone's work ethics different. It's not one person slacking in the gym, but just working, taking over. Everyone's going at it, everyone's working hard, so we're all bouncing off each other, working hard. Everyone's seeing you can get the... When, when you're doing the um, tempo drills, it's you can get the most combinations off on the bag, work, push, you can work the hardest, push each other, everyone, so everyone's constantly pushing each other. Fight big performance, obviously I'm always looking for big, give, give a big performance for everyone, exciting performance and better than last time, so every time I look as I can just get better and better, show off where I've learned, where I've improved and just show me skills basically. Yeah, it's a, obviously it is about getting around him but it's about getting knockouts are good as well because that's that's what gets people engaging in you and building your fan base up. Obviously if you you want to be exciting. That's what that's what sells tickets. That's what people come to see. People come to see excitement. Especially people that don't know boxing. So like when you're sitting around boxing people, they like to watch fights and people showcase the skills and obviously catch shots, offense, defense, move, angles and stuff like that. But the average crowd just wanna see people Swing their hands and see someone get knocked out. That's what they go there for. They don't know much about the sport. They just want to, just want to be excited and see someone, someone get knocked out, don't they? That's what people pay to see. So obviously I'm massive for the weight. I'm a middle, I'm super welterweight. I'm six foot four, six foot five, six foot five. So like, obviously I watch like the likes of Tommy Hands and stuff like that. Cause obviously I can pick up moves. Obviously straight shots, long shots. Like power, because obviously I, ca I carry power, so I, I it's hard. And then, but I like Javante Davis. He's at the minute he's my favourite fighter, and it, obviously he's polar opposite to me. But he's just what he does and how he does it. It's unbelievable. Like obviously, you don't want to fight in the future. But the way, I'd like to get in there with better Vidas to see how he, how he, what he does. Obviously, because his work rate's crazy. Obviously, he's boss. I'd like, but I'd like to be, be in there and feel, like see see how he is and. Feel his shots, you know what I mean? But yeah. Me, I just want to give the best performance possible for me, a big performance. It's on every, it's on the it's on it's where it's in Greenman, can it on our on our doorstep, so basically expect it to be busy, very busy. Obviously it's a, it, it's a small venue but it should be packed. It's a summer it's just a summer evening, like 
no one's got no excuses not to get down. So yeah, I just want to give a good performance, big performance, and push on again and just keep building.